Hi, I'm Al Gaboro with the Princeton Public Affairs Group. Welcome to this week's e-news update. This week, the Obama administration announced the first 10 states granted no child left behind waivers. The U.S. Department of Education has decided New Jersey, provided the state agrees to abide by the administration's preferred policies, will not have to meet the performance standards set forth in NCLB. Also this week, Governor Christie announced his selection of Ed Dixon as the new Director of Homeland Security and Preparedness. The former director, Charles McKenna, replaced Jeff Chiesa as Chief Counsel to the Governor. Following the stated position of Governor Christie, Senator Kip Bateman recently authored a Senate resolution that, if passed, would put the controversial issue of same-sex marriage on the November ballot. This week, the Red Tape Review Commission, chaired by Lieutenant Governor Kim Guadano, released a report detailing progress the state has made, reducing red tape and outlines further steps to make regulations less costly for business and nonprofit groups. The report is based, in part, on input received at public hearings the Commission hosted during 2011. The report highlights last year's significant changes implemented by the Christie administration to streamline government and cut red tape. Thank you for joining me. For more information, go to our website at ppag.com. Have a great weekend.